Hi guys, Rusty Boy 1985 here, back with a brand new video, and yes, this is a Blu-ray update video. Yes, I was going to come to you in in the next few days with this because I'm still waiting on a few packages. But you know what? I thought I've got a considerable lot here to show for this week, so I thought I'd leave that lot till next week because I'm sure I'm going to buy it maybe one or two more, um, depending on money. So guys, if you don't know, um, I have been, I purchased a Blu-ray player. I didn't show that, I know I said I was going to, but because um, I had to mod it myself, because um, it's like a, it was a Region B player, but um, I modded it myself to make it a, a Region 3 player. So I didn't really want to show you how I did that on uh, camera, because you never know who's watching. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, I've modded my Blu-ray player, and now it can be show, it can show be now it can be done with region A, region B, region C. So yes, thankful Lord, I have a region three player. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I'm gonna crack on. Most of these are um, horror related. Um, uh, as many people don't do know, I do like me a good horror film. So most of these are horror related, but I'm going to jump in with one from left field and, well, I say left field for me, it's not really. It's a Disney film. So um, the first one I'm going to show you is Disney's Aladdin. Um, got this for a great price and with slip cover as well. Um, it's The website I got this on is now defunct. Um, it was from... Oh, I can't remember now. Um, Skyler, Skyler.com, I think that's what, that's what it was. But it's, the website's now defunct. But man, I got this really fast, and they shipped from America, and I got this within like three days. Um, no kidding. And it, it was more than a Disney Blu-ray from the UK. This was twenty six pounds. I paid for this. Um, I knew this was going to come with a slipcover because it said. Um, but yeah, normally Disney in the UK, you're normally going to play for 17, 18 quid. But for seven quid more, I thought, you know, I'd get this with a slip cover. Because um, you know I love my slip covers. <laughs> okay, so here's Aladdin. There you go. Brand new features the um, this particular Blu ray uh, is uh, the Genie outtakes, which I've sat and watched and they are really good not not long but um really good there's the oh yeah got the movie movie reward code here folks so um i'm going to show you this now it ends october 13th 2017 so you've got a lot of time to um to redeem it but this is no use for me because obviously i'm in the uk so um there you go guys pause it and there you go. So, and there's the DVD and the Disney Blue Rock. So, yeah, I know I have this, I think I showed this ages and ages ago on my channel because I've got the still book, um, which is, again, which is all out of print now. So, uh, so yeah, there's the still book version. I'm just going to quickly show if there's any differences because I also don't want you to feel cheated, guys. Um, so, just a quick rundown. So, USA Aladdin. This has got the uh, Genie Outtakes, Genie 101, um, Unboxing Aladdin, Aladdin creating the Broadway mu uh, musical, Disney song selection, and more. And on the uh, the UK version, this has got a filmmaker's audio commentary, The Making of Aladdin, singing along with the movie, deleted scenes, music videos, and deleted songs. So I'm assuming when they say more on here, this is what you get. And the whole new thing was the outtakes of the Genie, Genie 101, creating a Broadway musical. So yeah, so I think you get more bang for your buck with the uh, Aladdin. So there you go guys. Okay, what should I show, show you next? Okay, again, all of these will be horror related now. There's only uh, three, um, but you know what, I just haven't, well, I've seen one of them, but I haven't seen these two. 
So um, we'll get one. We'll, let's, let's get the one out of the way that I've got and I've, I've seen before. Uh, now this is by um, this is a Region A title, guys. Region A. This is a Scream Factory Edition. Um, I can't believe I got it with a slip cover on eBay as well for a great price. I think I paid about twenty two pounds for this. Um, but it came with a slip cover. I didn't know it was going to come with it, so I'm more than happy to get one, uh, to get it with a slip. And that is a the third movie in George A. Romero's zombie zombie trilogy, and that is the Day of the Dead. Uh, I can't comment. I was going to watch this and then have a quick butchers at the video um, of the Arrow title that I have got. But uh, I haven't checked that out yet. But it is Donald Dead. Love, love this artwork. Absolutely brilliant. So um, there's that. There's the front. And there's the back. I don't know if this is coming in wonky because what I can see, it's all gobbledygook. It's all backwards. So, um, so yeah, so that's the front cover. The back as the same as the slip case. And get nice art work on the disc as well and on the back you get reversible sleeve so what do you get um, different to the arrow version um, apparently this has a new high definition transfer I heard they've kind of masked it from the Anchor Bay Stars release that they had a while back, but I'm not too sure. Don't quote me on that. So, without further ado, I'm going to bring in the UK version, Arrow version of Day of the Dead. Um, so that's that version. Out of print now, guys. Even the Dawn of the Dead. I've got Dawn of the Dead at the back of me. Um, that's going for a ridiculous price, isn't it? It's like, I think, last time I saw it, it's going for like 25... Look, 65 75 quid so i'm glad i've got the dawn of the dead version of this but quickly let's have a quick one down of the uh screen factory release first so we've got the new high definition transfer the new documentary world's end audio commentary with right director george romero special makeup effects artist tom zavini production designer cletus anderson and actress laurie cardilli I think that's how you say it. Behind the scenes footage from special makeup effects creator Tom Savini's archives, photo galleries, theatrical trailers, TV spots, and more. And uh, on the Day of the Dead Arrow release version, you have a uh, theatrical feature, Blu ray, commentary with a special effects team Greg Nicotero, Howard Berger, Everett Burrell, and Mike Deek. Joe. And then you've got Joe the Dead and Travel Log, whatever that is. And disc two contains The Many Days of the Dead, behind the zombies footage. Romero with some Zombo Graffery, Photo Album of the Dead, Souvenirs of the Dead, Night and Dawn Trailers, the Audio Recollections of Richard Liberty, TV Ads of the Dead, and Wampum Minor Promo. So maybe this has the new features on here um, for the Screen Factory release, but then this might have more on it. But again, this has a new high, tra high def transfer. So we'll see. But yeah, that is Screen Factory, Day of the Dead. Great film. I do like that. Everyone kind of slates on it, but um, I enjoy it. But my best is always going to be Dawn. Okay. Um, okay, I just got this one through the post today. So um, this is like fresh out the, the pack, as they say. But it didn't come with a zip cover. Am I annoyed? A little bit, but um, beggars can't be choosers. Uh, this is another Screen Factory release. Um, again, Region A folks in the UK, um, Screen Factory, Screen Factory is only Region A. So um, yeah, without further ado, the that is the next one is Nightbreed, the director's cut. It has the Blu-ray and DVD combo in it. Um, haven't seen this film. Heard a lot of mixed opinions about it um, by Clive, um, directed by yeah, directed by Clive Barker, who directs Hellraisers, the Hellraiser. And um, I watched a trailer for this. It, it did catch, it did um, catch my attention. So I thought, you know what, I'll pick this up again for a great price. Same seller on eBay, twenty two forty nine. So 
I thought I would get slip cover with this, but you know what? Am I? Uh, I'm not that bothered, but it kind of irks me a little bit. But yeah, that is Nightbreed. So apparently, there's a few cuts to this as well. Um, but which one's the Blu-ray? So that's the Blu-ray, that's the DVD. And if I take the uh, Blu-rays out quickly, and you get the reversible sleeve as they do. So uh, yeah, guys, if you have seen this, please. Please let me know what this is like. I might actually watch this tonight. Um, so, well, no, I probably will do because I definitely want to see it. Like I say, definitely the trailer grabbed my attention. So, and that is so that is Clive Barker's Nightbreed. Again, great price. Disappointed it didn't come with a slip. Okay, so the last one. I wasn't going to pick up. I don't know if I had any interest in whatsoever. The original was. Uh, one of the, you know, really good horror. Uh, but I saw this in HMV. I was just walking around HMV, my local um, Blu-ray store, and I saw this for six ninety nine. Um, I know this was about, so you know, I wasn't like, oh my god, it's out and and stuff. I, again, haven't seen this film. A lot of mixed opinions about it. Uh, I think it's got this sort of cult status around everyone at the moment but um yeah i always see this on a couple of people's blu-ray collections but not a lot so without further ado i saw this for 6.99 and that is the texas chainsaw massacre 2 the buzz is back um yeah watch a trailer for this after i got it and it looks okay i'm not gonna it's not gonna lie it's probably gonna be a grower but i see this on a few people's updates but I haven't seen it. I have not seen this. So um, again, guys, if you have, drop a comment down below and let me know what it's like. So, but this is the Arrow big box set. Six, again, like I say, six ninety nine in HMV. Cannot believe it. I know Arrow is doing a, a five for thirty deal at the moment. On, um, I'm not sure how it's going to last. How long it's going to last? But they're doing a five for thirty in HMV, and it includes Arrow titles as well. So, but anyway. Okay, let's get all this out. Okay, so obviously the first, the first bit of uh, the first uh, digit. All oh, this is digi pack. Uh, all of these are digi packs. So, so yeah. So you get the uh, first bit. So you get a uh, cool little uh, poster art for the poster that was released, and then uh, this is a certificate as well. So if you can see it's 4906 I think it is, yeah. So out of 10,000, I think it's 10,000. And obviously Arrow's Gump of what's coming next. And then you have the uh, Blu-ray, a bit of, well, you can see the chainsaw at the back there. So that's disc one. This is disc two funny because the uh, packing comes with <laughs> as you saw the first one says Texas this just change this is says chainsaw and then this the other one I'm going to show later the same massacre on it so but yeah I think right yeah okay so two and disc two and three are two Tobe Hope Tobe Hoopers uh, early works from one's a DVD and the other one's blu-ray so this might be the same disc but on different formats again don't quote me i should really look up on this stuff really shouldn't i uh, and the last one is a a huge as you can tell huge booklet and um yeah just all different things about the film nice glossy pictures So, so yeah, so and that's the book. I don't know how big, how much pages there is of this. A hundred page, hundred page book. Uh, so yeah, there you go. So I'm not going to put it all back in yet. But yeah, that is Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part Two, six ninety nine, guys. If you like this film and you're in the UK, try and hunt this one down. They have like three in my store, so it's great. 
So there you go, guys. Not a lot of titles, but I think a good lot of content, should I say. But I was expecting, like I said at the beginning, I'm expecting another couple in the post in the next few days or so. But I'm also waiting on another one. So I thought, you know what? Get this Blu-ray update out of the way. And then next week, I'll probably have another one. So we can make it another Blu-ray update for you guys. So um, that was my thinking. I think that's quite a good thinking. <laughs> so there you go, guys. You know, that was my bundle of uh, horror goodness. Plus thrown in a bit of Disney title. So um, thank you, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I uh, really do appreciate you um, watching, as always. If you've got any... Uh, thoughts of any of these titles drop a link uh, drop a comment down below and i'll get back to them as always so until then guys please rate comment subscribe and i'll see you all guys later thanks so much for watching